Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Mature. Guys, I'll catch you guys with another banger, man. Now, today's video, I'm gonna be showing y'all the best center build. I know a lot of you guys have been waiting, waiting on this build. I know it's gonna be a really good build, and I can't wait to show it to y'all guys. I know y'all are gonna be like, oh my god, Metro, how do you get that build head ass? Now, let me stop playing, bro, but this build is a godly ass build. <clears throat> I'm gonna show y'all everything which y'all wanna do. First thing you wanna do is y'all wanna come all the way down here. You want to you want to select this build. You want to do red. Go all the way red because you know what I mean. You're gonna be a you're gonna be the best. You're gonna be a glass cleaning lockdown. That build is a godly godly build. I'm gonna show y'all. I don't know if I'm gonna have any gameplay, but I'm, I'm I'm promise you. You use this build, and I promise you, you'll do really really good. But yeah, I recommend everybody using this build, especially for sinners and stuff like that. It's good on the two v two court on the one v one court. It's gonna be a banger. It's gonna be a banger build. Even a video, man. Hey man, if you made it this far, I need y'all to comment. Metro is trash in this trauma section. You know, I'm not, I'm, you know what I'm saying? Right. Anyways, the, the last pie chart, that's what I recommend doing. You don't have to do that, but that's what I recommend. In the, in the pie chart that you want to do next is you want to go to the bottom one on this one. So you can have pretty much everything. Everything's pretty much neutral. You know what I mean? Everything's the same. So stuff like that. <clears throat> what, what you want to do is you want to get in here. You want to come down here and upgrade everything on defense, man. You want to have your offense rebound up. You want to have your defense rebound up. You want to have everything up. Everything on defense wants to be up. That's, that's the goal. To your defense, we're going to max that out. <laughs> Steel, we're gonna max. <clears throat> I'm gonna come up here. You wanna the reason you wanna max this out is because you wanna um you know what I mean? Stuff like that. You wanna go to horse, you wanna be able to play defense, you know what I mean? Look at that interior defense, 95. If you're going against like a pure post or something like that, he has no 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 chance against you. Next thing you wanna do is you want, I would recommend is putting your standing dunk. You're standing you're gonna max out your standing dunk and 95 standing dunk. You know how good that is? That is amazing, man. 95 standing dunk, that's a, that's that's good. It's really good. And I, the next thing I, the next things I would recommend doing is like, you know what I mean? I'll put your free throw to at least like a cool 65. So you're, so you're not missing free throws because uh, you know what I mean? You're going to be missing if you don't. <clears throat> and also, I will, I will maybe, you can maybe put your driving dunk to at least a 65. So you can get that 10 finishing badges, you know, stuff like that. <clears throat> you can um even, you can even put your mid range up to a little bit if you want to be able to shoot like in park and stuff like that. And it's just up to use personal preferences. But I'm just gonna show y'all this build like that I made and that I liked a lot. It was a really, really good build, and I recommend everybody using it. You don't have to though, but if you do use it, like y'all gotta let me know how it is, man. Y'all gotta let me know. Tell me if it's a good build or not. But yeah, I, I would just put your, I would just put everything up like this. Then, I, then, then the um last things, I would just put your pack. I would just no, no, I would do post hook. Put it to like a, you got ten left. I would just do your pass accuracy to a fifty-seven, so you can have that pass accuracy. You know what I mean? The next thing I recommend doing putting your build body shape to build you know what I mean you don't want to be anything you don't want to be none of that <clears throat> next thing I recommend doing is putting a 611 center the reason I'm going this short is because look what you get look at your vertical look at your speed on the right on the right hand side and look what you get plus seven perimeter defense plus nine lateral quickness plus six steel plus two pass actually plus one ball handle that's a that's really really good plus five driving up this is a good this is a good really high your verticals gonna be up too so you can pretty much force on people you know stuff like that that's gonna be very helpful in the long term especially if you're especially to the pro and players out there very very helpful and the next thing i recommend doing is putting your strength putting your strength to at least a 245 i would just do 245 it's like it's it's there it's in the middle it's like that so you want you know you want to be kind of a big body too you know you don't want to be weak and stuff like that <clears throat> the next thing I recommend doing is putting your wingspan to at least at least maxing it out 93. You don't have to though. You can just leave it normally, normal. But I'm gonna max it out because I want to be able to grab boards easier. You know stuff like that. But your strength does go down if you want to take that into account. Your strength does go down when you max out this. But it's just all personal preference, man. <clears throat> but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and make this build. Glass cleaner. You know what I'm saying, bro? You know what I'm saying? Look at that, bro. Glass cleaner. Like we play like Bill Russell, Andre Drummond, and DeAndre Jordan. And I can agree. I can agree. And y'all can agree too, chat. That that's gonna that's they're pretty much glassing the lockdowns. I don't know about Andre Drummond. I don't. I would just say he, Andre Drummond's a pure glass. That's just my opinion, you know, stuff like that. But you know what I mean. It's all personal preference. <clears throat> but look what you look at the 99, man. Look at the 99, man. I already know, bro. Vertical goes up and strength goes up. This is gonna be a crazy build. I can't wait to show y'all. I can't wait to show y'all, man. <clears throat> all right. Now, now this right here you want to take into account because this right here is the most important thing that you y'all got to take into account because you're gonna need this. The first thing I would recommend putting on Hall of Fame is box. You want to be able to box out your opponents. That's gonna be very helpful because you're a center. You know what I mean? You want to be able to box out. You don't want to be weak. You know stuff like that because you know you don't want to be like trash. You know. <clears throat> 
The next thing I, rec I recommend maxing out is your brick wall. Brick wall Hall of Fame, you want to be able to set big bodies, you're going to glass clean lockdown. You want to be able to set good screens, you want to be able to get rebound and stuff like that, you know. It's just, it's just how it works, you know. The next thing I would recommend upgrading is post move lockdown Hall of Fame, man. Improves the abil defender's ability to defend post moves. That's, that's, I promise you that's so helpful, especially going into those pure post 99s in the future. They're not going to be able to do as, as much as they used to. So that's going to be very helpful. Next thing I recommend doing is upgrading your rim, rim protector to Hall of Fame, man. You want to be able to get them big body blocks, especially on them little baby guards, slashers that are that are OP now in the game. You want to be able to get good blocks on them, you know, stuff like that. Because, you know, if you know them so far, they're so OP. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. But if you made it this far, man, y'all got to type in 1K in the comment section. That's how I know that you're loyal and that I can trust you. And, uh, and then maybe you can earn a mod in my stream. Maybe... Maybe I'll give you something, man. Maybe I'll give you some MT in the future, maybe. You know what I mean? And I appreciate that if you made it this far. <clears throat> Next thing we're going to upgrade is rebound, rebound Chaser. It's a Hall of Fame. Improve ability, player's ability to chase and rebounds. That's very helpful. Especially when you're, like, running. Like, say if you're on the top of the key and, you and you're running. That's very helpful. Very, very helpful. Next thing I recommend doing is Intimidator to Hall of Fame. Intimidates offensive players, causing them to miss shots tomorrow. That's going to be very helpful. Especially in the paint, man. For all my paint players out there, that's very, very helpful. <laughs> Okay, and the next thing, the next thing, I, I'm i going to suggest something. Okay, what I'm going to upgrade is Pickpocket Hall of Fame, but but I highly, highly recommend upgrading Tireless Defender, Pick Dodger Hall of Fame. I recommend upgrading that, but I'm going to upgrade this because it's like, you know what I mean? It's just going to be better. But, <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to upgrade Pickpocket Hall of Fame because, you know what I mean? I want to be able to reach for the ball, especially the like, people that are like, you know what I mean? Try to like do something and like they're trash and stuff like that. But that's what I highly recommend doing. You don't have to do it. It's just all in per personal opinion, you know. And the two things that I recommend like putting your thing on is insert interceptor silver. I can't even talk, bro. Whenever I say this, whenever I say this badge of videos, I cannot talk. Yeah, I recommend putting that on silver. Get increases chances of getting sealed and passing lanes. Yes, you're gonna want that, and you're gonna have long arms, so it's gonna be even better. All right, all right, guys. So in put in. And playmaking badges, what you want to do, you have a lot. You can upgrade, you can upgrade break, break starter. You can upgrade, you can upgrade a lot of things because break starter is going to, um, especially for pro am, it's going to help. Even though if it's on bronze, it doesn't really matter, you know, it's going to help. But that's why I recommend upgrading. Next thing I recommend upgrading is catch and shoot to bronze at least. At least, if you want to like change anything, you can change anything. I'm just going to show y'all like what I, what I, what I think. Okay, here's the fun part right here. Here's the fun part. All right. Hold up. What I recommend creating two things, man. First thing you want to do is upgrade your drop stepper. You, you know, um, centers use drop stepper a lot. It's going to be very, very helpful in the long run. So I recommend upgrading. You don't have to recommend. You don't have to upgrade anything. But yeah, that's what I would recommend doing. And the next thing you want to do is a consistent finisher. You want to be able to be consistent with it. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to be able to miss a lot. You know, that's one thing you don't want to do. And if y'all just heard that big noise, that was my, that was my table. I just hit my table. And like I keep moving away from my mic, but I gotta my dog keeps wanting to come in here, so I let it in here. <clears throat> the next thing I recommend upgrading is your contact finisher to gold. Look at it, improves the ability to convert contact layups and dunks in traffic. That's gonna be very good. That's gonna be very, very helpful. All these badges are help helpful so much, man. Next next two things I'm gonna upgrade is Giant Slayer to gold and relentless finisher to gold. If you read Giant Slayer height, height is the effectiveness of layups over tall defenders, that's what we want because we're gonna be going against big center, like seven foot and stuff like that. So seven foot, I'm six eleven. It's gonna be very helpful. I don't know if anybody think thought of that. It's gonna be very helpful in the long run. <clears throat> Yeah, that's pretty much it for badges, though. Like, I, we're done. Oh, oh no, no, okay, okay. Let me go choose a jumper. I, I mean, I, it really is all personal opinion, but I'm gonna use I'm gonna use Kyrie for my center. Really, really doesn't matter because you're a center, you know, stuff like that. But yeah, man, I can't wait, man. 2K20 is gonna be our year. I, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna try to get better at editing, like doing jump cuts and stuff like that. But I mean, I'm I'm gonna need some help. If any editors are watching the stream and wanna help me, then I'll be glad to. You can teach me, man, because I'm, I'm down to, like, practice editing, you know what I mean? I, I want to get better at editing, but, I mean, everybody enjoys my videos, and I appreciate that, so, you know, it is what it is. You can't, can't do anything about it. <clears throat> but, yeah, I'm going to show y'all this build is good, man. We're going to be, you know what I mean? You already know, you already know what we about to be doing. We about to be killing people out here, you know what I'm saying, man? You know what I'm saying? All right, all right. Look how fast I am. See this? Look how fast I am. I'm too fast, man. I'm too fast. This is crazy build. I don't know if I'm going to have any gameplay because, like, you know what I mean? I didn't record it when I was playing, so I didn't record it 
honestly forgot forgot to like i was just playing a career and i literally forgot to record or press the record button on my ps4 so you know i said these big body screens big body screens oh uh, oh uh, green Look at that big screen, man. It's, it's built such big screens. Plays defense is fast. It, it's vertical. It's insane. Man, this built a godly build, man. It's too good, man. It's too good for me. I want, I want, I want, I want Willie Call Stein to get the ball. Give him the ball. Imagine setting a double screen for D'Lo. You're trash. Oh, oh, let's go. Oh yeah, we. Hey, I'm, I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna show y'all. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Oh my god, he found me, man. But man, I want, I want y'all to know, if you made it this far, comment green, man, green. And this being boy Metro, and if it ain't green, it ain't going in. And I'm out. Peace.